solo jump sesh. Not really sure what I'm climbing today, aside from a few short-term projects, one of which is that red guy right behind me. Starts with a really wild dynamic move to establish. But yeah, aside from that and like two others, I'm just kind of playing it by ear today. I'm climbing in my haggard ass shamans today, as you can see. Just thought I'd use these one last time, get a little bit more friction on the wall. But yeah, uh, let's warm up on this red V3 slash four. It's kind of weird. I'm not really sure what the beta is. Surprise appearance by Galen. Yeah, I was not intending to get Yes. I can just go straight up to this. Huh. Yes, I don't need that. You made that look easy. <laughs> Alright, well, Galen had to leave, so back to projecting on this red V5 slash 6. I'm thinking that maybe if I get my right foot a little bit further to the right, it'll push me in more thus causing less swing, but I don't know. In theory, it should work, but let's see.
That's so embarrassing. I had it. I just panicked and uh, didn't maintain core tension. Went for the wrong hold. Uh, and those aren't even bad holds up there. It's like the, uh, the pocket I was on is like so-so. But those two are both great. But I just kind of flung my hand out and didn't actually try. So at least it should go. But um, in the meantime, while I regain my strength, here are the shoes that I'm getting. Oh, if it focuses, there we go. Sticking with the Volve because these shoes never let me down. Obviously these ones are beat to hell, but that's why I'm using them on this problem. I just figured I'd be, you know, wasting a lot of rubber from just slamming against the wall repeatedly. So those will be my new gym shoes. And then the Phantoms will mostly be for like uh, outdoor bouldering and sport climbing. So I'm pretty excited. Yay, I did it.